Okay, so I'm going to go make coffee. And I have my trusty cameraman who wants nothing to do with me. They've got to drink the coffee anyway. So this is our super luxurious modern day kitchen. Pan. If you are in more convinced stove to turn on. Turn on. Turn on. Turn on. It's on. Sort of. Do not put saucepan on stove yet, as it will burn. Stove is very uncontrollable. Get milk from fridge. Milk from Morocco comes in containers. No milk ads for us here. No. Why didn't you wash your teacup? Get me another one. No, we only have we only have two key teacups, so you have to wash the teacup when you're done with it. Pour milk into saucepan. Put saucepan on stove. Look for other teacup. Where's your teacup? It's outside. What? Go get your teacup. No, I'm camping. How am I gonna make I'm, you I'm filming. I can film you. Go yeah, get it. You're gonna have to get it and wash it. I'm not washing it for you. Measure out another cup of milk. Do you want me to stop recording? No. Okay, then you'll get the coffee. Oh my god, why are you like this? Put them outside. Where did you see that? Outside. Nothing. Put it back on. It is on. Just waving at your friends. Wash dirty teacup full of tea that child didn't drink. It wasn't tea. It was whatever it was. teaspoon and fork. We have limited. We have one teaspoon and one fork, which we keep after we keep having to wash. Get your instant coffee. Smell the instant coffee. It smells good. Put one teaspoon for each cup in the cup. And just a little bit more to make it strong. Oh, should we put that coffee white here in? Why are you laughing? <laughs> and, uh, Why are you laughing? We have nothing better to do. It's fun. And there was no cream. So we're using all the stuff that I would never have used. Tell me, tell me the joke. Tell me the joke. I want to know what's funny. Uh, I'm so, sleep deprived is what's funny. Do you have a knife? Oh. So how did you open this yesterday? Ah, there it is. Put some coffee whitener or cream if you have it in with the coffee. Put it somewhere so it doesn't fall. Put a tiny bit of milk, and if you have cream, that's the best. And then stir. Okay, you have to stir. Nice outside in Canada today. Send us pictures. Put pictures in the comments. We want to see what it looks like back home. Can you see the coffee? Yes. You have to keep beating it. I'm beating it and beating it. 
and the milk is boiling for them to milk. Jennifer wants to know, how are you both doing any news of your return? Uh, no, we have no idea how long we're stuck here, and we're just trying to stay calm and not panic and not have all the re anxiety-related issues because people keep freaking out and telling us to come home immediately because the world is ending. But the airports are full of anxious panicky, COVID-ridden travelers, and we don't want to die in the airport without food, water, and of an awful virus, so we're staying in our Airbnb. <clears throat> and, okay, you keep eating this, it kind of changes color, you can't see it because our lighting in the kitchen is Sanan so awesome. Sanan Moore says, hello, Kesiho, stay safe. Hi, Sanan, fine, thank you. You also stay safe. Please don't go anywhere. So, once your milk is boiled and you keep getting the heck out of this, oh, it's like Bob Ross, beat the devil out of it. See, even coffee is artsy. So sad. <laughs> and you can tell how de desperate the times are if your teenager is agreeing to, oh no, you're not a teenager anymore. I keep forgetting. If your child is agreeing to help you make videos, is she done? Yeah. Okay, so the interruptions are due to my little child who's calling me and I guess asking us not to embarrass ourselves. No, she Facebook. just she's just annoying us. Anyways, hi to the five people who bothered to watch this amazing video. Sorry, it's only four now. Okay, it's only, only three four. now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the milk has boiled chill in the milk. And this is all whipped up, and then you take your saucepan, not burn yourself, and very carefully pour it into the cup. And do the fancy thing so that it gets like nice and foamy. And then do pour it back. Oops. Ew. That's okay. And it looks all nice and foamy, like something that came out of a machine. Except we did it on our own. And pour it into both the cups. And there is Desi coffee ready. Here, do you want to talk drink. to your phone now? What phone? I have to drink it and see if it's okay. Can you put sugar in this? Why would you do that? <laughs> Make it stop. What, what did you do? Stop it. I don't know how to stop this. Why are you like this? Okay, so there's the coffee. And don't forget to put everything back in the fridge and clean everything off your counter because if you're living in Morocco, anything left on the counter will attract a large number of red ants yeah, who sugar. bite. And yeah, put some more sugar in it. Some more sugar. More sugar. Okay, that was okay. Yeah. I thought you already put some. Well, it was just a little bit of that coffee creamer, so I don't know how much that is. Okay. Stir your coffee. Enjoy it. Your friend probably thinks you've lost your mind. I. No, they know I'm like this. So. Are you sure. Yeah, you only live once. If I wash this, I'd think you. Okay, let's see. Can you please make the googly eyes stop? Oh my god, can you make the googly eyes stop? How do you make them stop? Stop them! No, it's not funny, make them stop! I just wanna... Never have children. Never ever have children. Let's go outside and drink our coffee. Please make the googly eyes stop. Can you, can you just make the googly eyes stop? Okay, we were going outside. It was raining last night and it got super cold in the house. We thought we were going to die because there's no such thing as indoor heating here. And we would have taken you outside, but last night um, Morocco declared an emergency and you're not allowed outside without a permission form or to go grocery shopping. So when we go grocery shopping, we will take you along with us and show you what the grocery shops are like. It's really nice out now. It's better. 
Can you please make the googly eyes stop? No. I just I just want them to stop. My name. It doesn't benefit me for the googly eyes. No, I don't stop. like the googly eyes. Make them stop. <laughs> no. No, I just made Fine. them stop. Fine. Oh, there it is. Normal. <laughs> she just snorted. So now we're just enjoying our coffee with no googly eyes. And I hope everybody back home is staying inside because the faster this thing goes away, the faster we come home. It's really crappy. Everybody wants to just come home. And there's a lot of, I keep getting messages, which I appreciate, but there is a lot of panic at um, European airports. There is no straight flight out of Morocco from Morocco to Canada. We'd have to take an eight hour drive to Marrakesh first, which we really don't want to do. Eight hours in a car with a whole bunch of people we don't know. And whether or not they have a virus or not is not very a, a very attractive option. And then from Marrakesh, you would try to book a flight, standing in lines at the airport and hoping that you get um, you get a, a seat on a plane. And from there, it's either London or Paris. Um, for some reason, it's hard for Canadians to get out of Paris. I don't know why. And so we've decided to just stay put because the thought of going to a European airport with um, a whole bunch of travelers who are anxious and panicky and um, getting all hyper and who knows who has the virus. Um, we don't want to be in close quarters with anybody like that and bring the home, uh, bring the virus home to Canada. So for now, we're just staying here until I guess things get back to normal. And it's really kind of anxiety causing because you don't know what to do. But um, I guess the best thing is not to panic and just stay put and wait till we have any news because people have gone to different cities and gotten stuck there with no hotels and no food and no water and they don't know where to go from there so at least we're at an Airbnb we have access to groceries and stuff so we're just sitting it out and I will show you the lovely view and then say bye for now I hope you can hear the birds there's a lot of birds they sound really nice it's really cold today Okay. Everybody take your vitamin C and lots of water. Bye.